cards. Is it your first time visiting us here at the aquarium? It is? Well, we are so very honored and I'm more than happy to help you have an amazing first visit. Can I ask why you were interested in visiting us for the first time? You're really into biology and sea life. Oh, Oh, and conservation efforts. Well, I can assure you that our aquarium is one of a kind. We really focus on rehabilitation of domesticated sea life or animals um, and rescue efforts for certain animals. And we're working very hard with conservation groups and efforts in order to help not just ocean life, but also energy, renewable energy, um, sustainability. So we're pushing quite a few initiatives here at our aquarium and all of our um, entry fees for the aquarium along with any memberships or donations that we raise go directly to those efforts and rescuing and rehabilitating these precious creatures. Mm -hmm super important um, and so we're here to educate and help the community learn more and get connected and volunteer or find ways in their own communities to help the ocean life and our world in general. Yeah. Well, tell me, are you interested in properly visiting us today or did you just want to learn more? You wanted to visit, okay. Absolutely no problem. I can go ahead and set you up for a visit today. And if you're interested, I could also introduce our membership levels just so you're aware um, of those additional uh, benefits of being a member with us. Yeah. Okay. So the fee for today would be about $30. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I can go through the pricing of the membership fees, which obviously we do to save you as much money for any future visits you would like to have. And our aquarium is not just featuring our precious animal friends, but also have plenty of events just exclusive to our members um, as well as education programs and even efforts that extend beyond our aquarium center. Um, so there's so much more to uh, explore, essentially, with the membership. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Well, we can do the one-time entry fee today. Then, um, if you're interested in membership later, we can go through that together. Yeah, no problem. Is it just you today or do you have anyone joining you? Just you, okay. Experiencing the aquarium solo is actually a great way to really be um, involved in the environment, really learning and taking your time to. A lot of time people will just take a seat and meditate or journal as well. Yeah, so let me go ahead and get you set up. Can I get your first and last name, please? And an 
email. Here's the license. All right. And then just this card. Okay. I hope you don't mind. I'm just going to go ahead and type it in since I my scanner is down for some reason. It just sometimes happens that way. Okay. All right. So, you should be all set up. You won't need a badge. However, if you do leave the front entrance, um, there will not be a way to return back in. Um, so, if you do need to leave the vicinity, um, or if you have some kind of emergency, you can come up to our desk and let us know. But we usually don't let anyone back in, just because it is gets a bit busy, and it's more of a crowd control um, deal. Yeah. Yeah. But I would say about roughly one to two hours average a visitor will spend here. Um, there's so much to explore. Yeah, absolutely. Okay. Now, um, would you like a pamphlet to help you throughout your visit today? Okay, let me grab one for you. This is our pamphlet. It's our 25 year anniversary as well, so we have some splendid exhibitions to share with you throughout our aquarium. Yeah, so I can even go through it with you if you would like. Yeah, it's no problem at all. Like I said, I'm not that busy and we have other people taking care of our guests, so I'm happy to go through this with you. It's no problem whatsoever. Wonderful. I will go through this with you. Yeah, I'll just go ahead and um, come over to the side so I can really just go through everything with you. Okay. All right, so let's go through our visitor guide and map together very um, engaging pamphlet for our aquarium. Very educational and will help you throughout your visit. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, so first here we have the first floor gallery map. This will be really helpful for you navigating. It can be a little winding uh, hallway, so it's good to have a map on hand just in case. So we have the first floor gallery map on this side, then on this side we have the second floor. So there are two floors, okay, and there is also outside um, areas as well. Okay, so there's a bit of guide info, animal touch for the health and safety of our animals, please be gentle. Where it is indicated you are able to touch an animal, um, there is strict guidance on how to go about that, okay? Vanishing animal. The symbol identifies animals that are threatened or endangered. That's that signifier. And then um, we also have a visitor guide mobile app. Okay. Um, 
really briefly down here. Um, it's get embossed like a boss. So this is a interactive guide where we have eight embossing stations. It's kind of like a big stamp. Um, so you can emboss pages 7, 9, 11, 13, 15, 19, 23, and 29. So when you bring your visitor guide to uh, those stations on those pages, you'll be able to stamp the actual pages. So it not only acts as a guide, but as a memory piece for later. You will also notice the emblems here. These circles. These are the stamps or embossing stations for these particular animals in these departments. Okay? So we're going to go through some of these um, exhibits a bit more closely in the next pages. Yeah, super interactive. It's very good with the kids for sure. Is some general information. So we have first aid emergencies lost and found. You can find um, all of those near member services, which is here. And then no smoking or gum is prohibited. So smoking, vaping, gum, and balloons are not allowed in the aquarium. Please use trash and recycling bins and you do not toss objects into the exhibit. Visitor information is located at member services, so you can always come up to us for any information, like the membership, there's boat tours, special events, dining and refreshments. Cafe Scuba is on level 2 and serves a selection of sandwiches, salads, and grilled entrees, including sustainable seafood and vegan options. Bamboo Bistro in Shark Lagoon offers pizza, hot dogs, cold beer, and refreshments. The Blue Whale Cafe in the Great Hall serves coffee, cappuccinos, sodas, and snacks. So, plenty of options for food and snacks. And we do serve alcohol in certain areas. Restrooms and baby care station. You can see the map for restroom locations. And there are changing stations in all restrooms on levels 1 and 2. A baby care room is located off of the first floor women's restroom. Visitors with disabilities, if you need any assistance for any members um, or yourself, please visit our member services for any information. All exhibits are wheelchair accessible, and we also have locations with elevators. Okay. Sensory processing needs are also something we can assist with, so you can check here at the member services desk for any information on that and what we can assist with. Amazing pictures, purchase a unique souvenir of your aquarium visit with this fun photo opportunity located in the Great Hall. And then just a bit about the credit cards we accept. Okay, we really try to push recycling. We have very specific trash bins for all types of recyclables, food waste, and composted on site. Um, and you can also pour out liquids into special collection bins. Okay, if you would like to explore some additional adventures, we do offer animal encounters, a tour with an educator, and you can interact with animals and animal care staff. Age restrictions do apply and reservation is required. You can um, experience a harbor tour and um, those are um, off-site, but we can help navigate those for you and set those up out in the near ocean, and then whale watching is also something we can help um, you explore as well. Again, we have our visitor app for more information. We do have Wi-Fi, and we also put on some shows throughout some major exhibits. And you can look for certain signs or on the app for the different times of the shows. Over here, we just have a bit more about our aquarium So here we have the Southern California Gallery. This gallery represents the Southern California and Baja coasts between Point Conception in Santa Barbara and the tip of Baja California, Mexico. This is on the first floor. 
there's a octopus and le leopard shark embossing stations. There's an underwater viewing tunnel. You can see the seals and sea lions. Yes, very beautiful. You can also um, catch the bat ray embossing station. And this is the second floor. You can experience the Gulf of California. Some of our exhibits actually feature the actual tides that a lot of this marine life experiences out in nature where the, uh, they originate. So a lot of the um, exhibits have moving water and tides that represent where they come from. Yeah, it's quite fascinating. We have the Honda Blue Cavern. This exhibit is modeled after Blue Cavern Point, a marine protected area along the coast of Catalina Island. These are some of the different um, fishes <laughs> featured. The aquarium has an abalone lab where red and white abalone are reared. Along with others, we are breeding endangered white abalone and releasing them off the coast to help avoid extinction. And this is your circle indicating you can emboss this. And you would just place the page between the stamp, essentially, and press down. Yeah. So this is for the leopard shark. Okay. Next we have Casino Point, the Casino Point exhibit. Named after a site on Catalina Island, represents the diverse marine life that depends on kelp forests. Some animals are easy to spot, while others hide in the kelp. You have blue rockfish, Garibaldi, Senorita, lovely, cute name, and the Bat Star, to name a few. You also have some night crawlers, artificial reef. Beauty in the Deep, and Seagrass Meadows. Yes, so you can get embossing for the two-spot octopus if he will show his face. <laughs> Sometimes they like to hide. Or take a nap. That's what I like to think. Uh, seals and sea lions. Seals and sea lions live throughout our coastal waters. They haul out on quiet beaches, rocks, or in the case of sea lion structures like piers and buoys. <laughs> this is a cute picture. Um, we also have the Harbor Terrace. This outdoor space overlooks Rainbow Harbor and features archer fish and mudskipper exhibits and the Moon Jelly Touch Lab. To get to Harbor Terrace, exit the rear doors of Pacific Collections Gift Store or follow the walkway to the left of Lorikeet Forest. These are moon jellies. They're very popular <laughs> and cute. Lorikeet Forest is our Avery home to more than 70 lorikeets native to Australia, Indonesia, and New Guinea. Purchase a small cup of nectar to feed the lorikeets, and they are likely to land on your arm, shoulder, or head as you walk through the exhibit. So we do feature some our water future learn more about where our water comes from and ways to conserve water in our daily lives see how you can save water at home with appliances, landscaping and day to day activities and this embossing section is for the Southern California Steelhead next we have Shark Lagoon Learn more about the importance of the ocean's top predators at Shark Lagoon. Touch sharks and rays in this exhibit's two touch pools. Mm -hmm. Okay, so these are some of the different sharks we feature. And then we have the Grey Reef Shark as another embossing station. So here we have Molina Animal Care Center. The aquarium's Molina Animal Care Center includes a veteran, veterinary hospital, holding tanks, and animal exhibits. Okay, we're getting into some of the penguins, which are my favorite, but 
the June Keys penguin habitat. So these penguins are native to South America. They're featured in our exhibit and they're part of an association of zoos and aquariums breeding program for these birds. Okay, we have the Ray Habitat Touch Pool, Shorebird Sanctuary. The next uh, embossing station is for the Bat Ray. Next, we have the Gulf of California. The Gulf of California is one of the world's most biologically productive and diverse seas. Learn about this important habitat. Now we can help protect the animals that live there. Beautiful fish. Just gorgeous. And not to forget the splendid garden eel. Northern Pacific Gallery. The aquarium's Northern Pacific Gallery focuses on the colder waters and fascinating animals of the Bering Sea. Visit our sea otters, diving birds, and giant Pacific octopus, and several species of sea jellies. So this is the second gallery map, second floor. Okay. Sea jellies. So sea jellies are found in ocean waters around the world. They lack a heart, brain, and lungs, and have existed on Earth for at least 500 million years. The lion's mane jelly and the warty comb jelly. Jellies are so fascinating. I highly recommend checking them out. And one of my favorite exhibits is the diving birds. Such playful, lovely creatures. These birds live in the icy waters of the northern hemisphere and can fly in the air and swim underwater. Isn't that fascinating? They literally dive and swim in the water, but they can also fly. So you have the tuft puffin, horned puffin, and the crested auklet. Uh, we also have the spiny king crab, very majestic, and the vermilion sea star. The deep ocean is a place of extremes, cold temperatures, high pressure, and low light. Animals that live in deep water have special adapt adaptations to survive. And this is for the Pacific And, of course, we cannot forget our friends, the otters. The sea otter habitat. The southern sea otter is found along the California coast from Monterey Bay to Point Conception, just north of Gaviota State Beach. The sea otter conservation. Southern sea otters are protected species in California. They were hunted to near extinction and still face threats, including oil spills, pollution, and climate change. Sea otter pup. Sea otter pups can be separated from their mothers in strong currents or if the mother is injured. After being rescued, some pups are able to return to the ocean after learning key survival skills from a surrogate sea otter mother. Oh, that's so sad and so nice at the same time. Here, our aquarium is working with the Monterey Bay Aquarium to help care for orphaned sea otter pups. Our adult sea otters will serve as surrogate mothers, teaching the pups how to eat, groom, and survive so that they can be released back into the wild. Such a precious, precious connection that they can be adoptive moms or parents is really very cool. Tropical Pacific Gallery. This is one of my other favorite exhibits. The aquarium's Tropical Pacific Gallery represents many tropical habitats, including Indonesia and the island nation of Palua, the westernmost section of Micronesia. So this features some of the most colorful exhibits that we have. The coral reefs, nature's underwater cities. Coral reefs are among the ocean's most diverse ecosystems. They are home to a quarter of all ocean fish species and are found throughout the world. Explore coral reefs in the Tropical Pacific Gallery to learn about conservation efforts and what you can do to help them survive and thrive in a changing ocean. I think now more than ever, the ocean um, is just a huge concern and something we can all really advocate for, considering it helps our world so much, and all these creatures help it thrive as well. Coral Lagoon Marine Nurseries. We 
drink some of these beautiful species. Yeah. We also have frogs. I know, it's a little um, unique. Learn how this fascinating class of animals relies on both land and waters to survive. Discover close to two dozen species of frogs and other amphibians that live in Southern California and in many other parts of the world. You might even recognize some. Here, our aquarium is caring for critically endangered mountain yellow-legged frogs behind the scenes. With the only seven small populations remaining, our tadpoles are essential to the species survival. Some have already been released to establish new populations in California's mountain ranges. And then we have the next embossment. Okay. Here we have Tropical Reef. It's the largest exhibit containing 350,000 gallons of salt. This exhibit features hundreds of colorful fish, rays, sea turtles, and zebra sharks that live among the beautiful artificial coral. And as you can see, we just have so many different kinds, unique fish. We even have a sea turtle rescue program. Our staff has rehabilitated rescued sea turtles for nearly two decades, often performing surgeries to treat injuries once deemed healthy, these sea turtles are released in nearby ocean waters. So here we have Pacific Visions. Learn about our relationship with our planet through high-tech multimedia exhibits, art installations, animal exhibits, and shows. We have our orientation gallery. And then we have our art gallery. And our theater show on coral reefs. Experience a stunning virtual coral reef dive in the show. Our future is in cities, on land, and in the ocean. Explore the diversity of coral reefs and how we can protect them. Okay. Babies. <laughs> Discover the key to our future as you learn about our baby animals, their fascinating behaviors, and biology, and how we have our Jelly Lab, Ocean Nurseries, and more on adults and babies, and flamboyant cuttlefish, and another opportunity for embossing the Bamboo Shark Egg. Okay, I think we've reached the end. So, a bit about what you can do. Help preserve and protect the nature that lives right outside our door. The first step is to get out and explore and discover the beauty and healing power of nature. Here is how you can help our local animals and habitats. Reduce your carbon footprint, conserve energy, and reduce your use of fossil fuels. Walk, bike, carpool, or take public transit whenever possible. Conserve water, set up lawns, plant low water landscaping. Reduce water use inside your home with shorter showers and wash only full loads of laundry. Recycle and keep trash out of nature. Very important. Recycle and choose re reusable bottles. Keep trash off the street to prevent it from entering parks, natural areas, waterways, and the ocean. Participate in cleanups. Respect nature. Stay on designated trails and keep your distance from wildlife. This protects habitats and prevents disturbing animals' natural behaviors. And finally, become an advocate. Learn more about how you can help support local nature organizations, educate others, and contact your political representatives. Then a short thank you to our donors, a bit about our aquarium, and a special thank you. And a big thank you to our volunteers as well. So, that is our pamphlet. I hope it proved helpful for you. Alright, well I hope this is really helpful for you. You found it really interesting, right? I know, it's very um, in-depth and also interactive. Um, and we find people of all ages truly 
enjoy this. Yes, I think you'll enjoy it. Okay, so I'll go ahead and leave this with you. And do let me know if there is anything else you might need during your visit. And if you um, need to go through the gift shop and find any souvenirs, you can also come over and check out with us at the end as well. Great, well then perhaps I'll see you later, but please enjoy your aquarium visit today. Have a wonderful time. your afternoon here. You really enjoyed it. Oh, and I see you've picked up some gift shop items. Is that true? Oh, great. Oh, you need help checking those out today? No problem. I can absolutely help. Okay, perfect. Yeah, I can go ahead and check those out for you. You had a really good time. I'm glad to hear that. Awesome. Yeah, you can just set Right. So what do we have here? Oh, we love a good t-shirt. Okay, so it looks like... Oh, this is nice. That is so great. Yeah, this is what's on sale. Oh, I didn't even realize. 50% off. That is a steal. I know. Yeah, we try to make our gift shop pretty affordable just know lots of families of all kinds come around and um, we try to do our best to make sure everything isn't too, you know, out there. So, I'm just going to make sure I grab this. issues, you could return um, or go online to see about returns. Yeah. Although some sale items might be uh, non-refundable. So yeah, looks like this one would be. Is that okay? Final sale? see that you have another clothing item, it looks like. Okay. Okay, so this one is a hoodie. Oh my goodness, this is so cute. Look at that. The dolphins. And you found the size you needed. Okay, that's good. Oh, you got the last one in your size. Okay, so I'm just gonna set that there. Let's see. This one's also a very affordable. I love to see it. Oh, trust me, I am an avid visitor of our gift shop, so I definitely like to keep an eye on. Everything that we get in. Some of my favorite things to do here. <laughs> okay, this is the duh, sweater. Alright. That's all checked in for you. So let me start. Okay, I'll put 
the next item in. Okay. Oh, and you have a couple more items here. Okay. Let's see. So we have. love to give souvenir magnets wherever I go and I usually try to get the flashiest looking ones. <laughs> you, you do. That's a lovely tradition. Yeah, I find that makes my fridge remind me of all the wonderful places I've been and just puts a smile on Is this okay right in the back? Okay. Here we go. Okay, and it looks like you've browsed our jewelry section. Oh, that's so beautiful. That's an anklet. I love it. Very ocean blue. Yeah, looks alright to you. Okay, lovely. Matches the sweater you got to. Okay. So, um, I might have to search this one up really quickly. Um, let me see. Yeah, it didn't come with the tag, so. Um, okay. I see. Very gorgeous. A fun anklet never goes wrong. All right. Well, that's all your items. How would you like to pay today? Oh, oh you were interested in maybe purchasing a membership as well with all the items? Okay. Um, I might have to charge that separately. Is that okay? Yeah. Just because I would have to go through in another system. Okay, I'm sorry about that. Okay, no worries. Yeah, thank you. Thank you so much. Okay. Um, and what I'll do is, um, I do have your email, and you do have technically a customer account. I could save the card now on your file, and then if you do decide to purchase a membership, we would just charge that. Does that sound? Okay. So I'll just enter this for now. And yeah, you can always, uh, you'll get an email that you've created an account and to set your password. And you can always go ahead and, um, you know, remove anything later, or update payment information if you decide. Okay, here you go. Okay, wouldn't you like a receipt today? Okay. So, I have your receipt. Put it in the back. Okay. I'll hand this over to you then, okay? Here you go. Alright, so let me go ahead and pull up our membership information. So with our memberships, you get to enjoy the aquarium over the course of 12 months um, with unlimited free visits, exclusive member benefits, and valuable discounts. So I'll go over some of the benefits of our membership. So members get unlimited free visits for 12 months. You also get 50% off parking with prepaid parking vouchers. You can get a 20% discount on guest admission tickets for any guests you might bring along, 10% discount in our gift stores, and 20% uh, discounts 
in, um, for gift stores during December. Discounts on day camps, gift memberships, and more. Invitations to members only events and previews of new exhibits. And free digital subscription to our member magazine, Pacific Currents. So I'll just go through the different levels. So the first level is our most expensive and best value. It is $2.99 for the year. And it's our plus membership level. All member benefits that I just mentioned are included uh, for one or two named card holders plus any children or grandchildren age 17 and under. So you do have the ability to transfer one other card on this particular membership account. Mm -hmm. So all those benefits I mentioned were included in the two the next one is $249 for a family membership level. This includes all member benefits for one or two named card holders plus children or grandchildren age 17 and under. And then our next membership level is $179 and it's a dual member level. It includes all member benefits for two named card holders. And then the $99 individual membership includes all member benefits for one named card holder. There are there is a 169 senior dual and $89 senior individual levels available for seniors over the age of 62. And you can purchase a membership for someone else. cancel, um, what you're doing is you're paying the fee up front to enjoy the rest of the year. Um, so let's say you did want to cancel in the middle of the year, um, you would still be able to enjoy the rest of the year with your membership, um, but then you would not be charged for another year. Yeah, so it's really up to you, but it is a fee that um, is not You still want to go through? Okay, cool. Well, we must have really impressed you today. <laughs> so, um, let me just go ahead and add that to your account that you've created with us. Um, I think I should be okay. Oh, can I actually get a billing address, please? Okay. should be all set and the card on payment um, will be charged that $179 um, and unless you cancel before your next annual renewal it will be automatically charged again so there will be an email sent to you with all this information um, and detailing everything out and of course if you have any questions or concerns please do call us or um, reach out to our support team via email um, or chat, and we will get right back to you. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Wonderful. Oh yes, we do notify all members of upcoming events and, um, exhibits exclusively, um, for you. So, uh, you can expect those in your email newsletters, and, um, you should be receiving one, I would say, very soon, notifying you of upcoming events. Well, it was an absolute pleasure helping you, and I can't wait to see you again. Um, was there anything else I could help you out with today? That's all? Okay. Sounds great. Well, do enjoy your souvenirs, and I hope you've had a lovely visit. We really do hope to see you again soon.